Hey guys and welcome back. So today I'm gonna be doing a haul. I just came back from the store and I bought a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm gonna start with Marshalls because I went there first and I was in need of oven mitts. So I got these. I turned my flash on because I'm not it's like super cloudy outside and someone's like honking and stuff. Anyways, these were $7.99 and they're just really nice. Like oven mitts, so I think that would be really great. I also really need to replace my wooden spoons. So I got this bamboo spoon set and these were $3.99 which I thought was a really good deal. Um, they're also dishwasher safe. I don't have a dishwasher but I thought it was, you know, if they're dishwasher safe they're more than likely going to be able to withstand like heat and whatnot. Um, so. Yeah, and if you do have a dishwasher, you can't use that. I also picked up this Kitchen Spaces, a large colander bin. And this is supposed to be able to keep your fruit fresher. I've heard a lot of good things about bins like this. Um, this was $12.99. So I really wanted to try it and see if it does keep our fruit fresher. Um, because our fruit does go bad kind of fast when I just wash it and put it in a bin so this is supposed to prevent from it going bad faster because of the little like holes the actual fruit is never touching like one solid spot at least that's what I've heard it also is like divided in the middle right here so if you want to put like strawberries and grapes or whatever you want or you and you can take the middle section off if you want to do like a whole thing of strawberries or grapes or whatever you want watermelon so i thought that was really great i also got this stila glitter no i'm sorry shimmer and glow in kitten and this was $5.99 and this is what these look like super pretty shade I don't know if you'll be able to tell oh I got one more thing that I forgot to sh bring with me um, but I got a ring light and I have to actually like play with it and I need to buy like a little cube because you need to be able to plug it in to like an outlet and um, it's a USB kind of thing so I have to find a little like cube to plug it in so that I don't have to use like my flash on my phone and stuff I can actually use the um, the ring light so that's actually in my room I totally forgot to bring it with me um, but that was like $14.99. They had a whole bunch of different like ring lights. That, so if you guys were interested in getting a ring light for pictures or whatever, not just, you know, for YouTube or whatever. Um, they're also really good for pictures. Um, I went to TJ Maxx next and then I found this Beauty Blender Bounce Liquid Long Wear Foundation. And I got it in shade 3.35W. And this was $12.99. This retails for like $40 at Sephora. Right now it's on sale for $20 in Sephora. But I got it for $13, which is even better than the $20. It's supposed to be full coverage, velvet finish, all kinds of stuff. Um, I don't know, there's a lot of mixed reviews on this. So I wanted to try it out. I was actually going to buy it from Sephora when I 
originally saw it was on sale but I decided to hold off and I'm glad I did because I did not expect to find this um I already swatched it and I think it's going to be my shade it might just be like a hair darker which will be fine because spring and summer is coming up and I'm okay with having like a darker foundation or like a tiny bit darker um I have to actually swatch it on my face to see if it's my shade but I swatched it on my hand and it seemed like it was fine um so the packaging is super cute it's a glass bottle again I got 3.35 they had other shades there too they had um 3.40 3.20 um what other shades did I see like 1.5 1 1.25 um and some other stuff I know they had a really bad reputation when they first came out with like their shade range um I don't know what the whole drama was and I don't honestly I didn't look into it but I really wanted to try this since they came out but I just didn't want to pay the price so I'm glad that I found that I also got these dose of colors eyeliners and I got these from Ulta I'm pretty sure they are getting rid of the dose of colors line because everything from that line is on sale right now I forgot to go look at at the aisle but i found this at like one of the uh end cap like cell sections and um sketch is one of my favorite eyeliners it's just a brown liner i'm not gonna open it just because i do have one open that i need to finish i'm almost done with it which is why i bought a second one because i'm pretty sure like for them to be this discounted which is 375 out of it says 15 but i'm pretty sure they were 20 when they first came out um and then i got this one in dark roast which i'm not exactly sure it looks like a brown as well so it's it's like sketch sketch is more like a dark like a black brown and this is more like an actual reddish brown so it's pretty and i will use it i have switched from using black eyeliner on the waterline to browns so i've actually been going through my brown ones really frequently and i'm glad that i got these and again their dose of colors 375 they had their highlighters on sale as well and liquid lipsticks some eyeshadow palettes online i think i didn't see them in store because again i kind of just went really fast and i didn't want to look um like everywhere um what else i went to hollister and i got this black t-shirt and this was 9.99 then they had an extra 40 percent so it's just a plain black t-shirt it's that like super soft like breathable stretchy material i love these kind of shirts so these were like i don't know six dollars or seven dollars after the 40. i didn't look at the receipt but i mean you can do the math i'm not going to <laughs> um and then i got this striped one which is also really cute this is like a gray yeah it's a gray with uh white stripes and this was also ten dollars and an extra 40 percent off i got the size medium for both so these are both the same like super stretchy breathable material i love these especially for summer when it gets really hot i think these will come in handy those have become some of my favorite shirts and then i got these curvy high-rise super skinny jeans in 7s and sorry my kids are being loud um they have like this ripped stuff at the bottom this is why i didn't do this as a, a summer video because my kids are being so loud um but they're just plain jeans and then they have rip at, rips at the bottoms which are super cute um plain pockets 
sorry interrupted as per usual um but these are super cute i tried them on in store because our fitting rooms were open and they are they just look so good on like they honestly look really really good on and these were on sale for twenty dollars and then they had 40 percent off so i got them for 11.99 which is a steal for jeans and i have been loving their jeans lately i've gotten so many pairs from them in the past like four months um i've showed you guys some and there's some hauls that i did not actually upload i forgot to post these but these are my favorite socks these are the adidas ankle socks and these were 9.99 there's another child walking by and um i love these socks i love how they fit um i love that you can't see them with the sneaker i'm actually wearing some um, right now <laughs> my kids are like my kids have never seen me film so right now they're like what is she doing is she filming videos does she have a youtube channel um so yeah that's that's what's happening in the background right now but anyways these are usually retail for twenty dollars again i got them for 10 i love these they're super durable um i love how stretchy they are and they don't really fall from the ankle um so i highly recommend these if you guys see them i just they're some of my favorite socks they're really breathable they're soft and they've held up really really well i wash them all of the time um because i only had a six pair before i also got a nautica um pair of these and i just don't like them as much they're a lot thinner and like they're just not my favorite so i i really recommend these these are really really good they're a little pricey um if you see like their other ankle socks that are not like adidas or anything um they're usually like five six dollars so i mean still a really good deal anyways i think that's all i have for you guys i don't want to make this super long um, but I did want to show you that I got some really, really good stuff at the store and I wanted to share it with you guys. I hope that you don't mind that this wasn't an ASMR video, but again, I really wanted to show you guys and, um, think I'm going to start doing some more of this kind of stuff, like just regular sit down, show you guys like certain things. I'm like super out of breath because I was like running around doing stuff, so... Anyways, I actually, baby's still sleeping. I'm going to do an actual ASMR video next. And hopefully I can get that in before he wakes up. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, bye guys.